All right, welcome back to Undertale. Would this be better? All right. Welcome back to Undertale, everyone. This will. I'm sorry that it will take a while for me to record any of these episodes because, you know, school started and it's not going to be online anymore. So I feel like I might be, might be very tight on doing all of these videos. I don't know. Whatever. All right. Last time we are here, back in Snowden. All right. We should save just. Just make sure. <coughs> Is a fishing rod affixed on the ground? Ready? All this attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me! Use my number. You decide not to call. Yeah, let's not. <laughs> uh, do I have anything else to say for this? Not much. Because. Let's see. So, yeah, we have the tough glove. And we kept the bird scotch pie because, you know, for for reasons. Let's see. Tough glove weapon attack fight. Not really into it. Well, anyway, we met Sans and Papyrus last time, and uh, I will be slow on doing these videos. And there's not much views yet. Uh, for the first episode, but I know some of you really liked it, and I'm glad you do because Undertale is such a nice game that everyone needs to know. Well, anyway, let's go. On. So, as I was saying about Undyne, <laughs> there you go, there you go. Spin around. <laughs> Sands. Oh my god, is that a human? Uh, um, actually, I think that's a rock. Ah, uh, hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god, it, is that a human? Yeah. Oh my god, Sans, I finally did it. And dying will, I'm gonna, I'll be so... Popular, popular, popular! <coughs> Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the great papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue. Only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep a nice socket out for you. <laughs> ah, sands without puns and not that. Uh, uh, oh my god, help. I, I like to order a, um, a pizza with uh, the toppings are. Uh, I have them copied. I'll just, just paste them to you. Your phone is too old to receive texts. It reads out loud, character by character, an ASCII art of an anime cat girl. Like, okay. Oh, oh ice cap. Uh, steal? You tried to steal ice cap's hat. But it's not weakened enough. Help! Fashion police! Ooh. Okay, go away. Okay. Wait, what? I just can't make sure this hat is still there. Ignore. I think it's ignore. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Hello, my hat's up here. Okay, let's go. Let's move around. Ice Cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. Just keep ignore. Just keep ignore. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. Seems defeated. Okay, I'll ignore you two. Goodbye. Uh, what's this? There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this? You ponder. 
I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very famous guard, royal guardsman. <laughs> oh, papyrus. Okay, we, we read this. Okay. Absolutely no moving. Hmm. Does something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Let's pet him. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. <laughs> the doggo can't seem to find anything. Pet. You pet the doggo. What? I've been pet? Pot, 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 pat, 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 pat. <laughs> okay, go away. S -s something pet me. Something that isn't m moving. I'm gonna need some dry trees for this. Hmm? Hello? Is anybody there? No? Are you two playing a trick on me? Real funny. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Sir, uh, found your, found your, uh, dog treat? Ah, I cannot ring it again. Ding, ding, ding. Hello. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? I'm fighting? Think about blue stop signs. I already know that, Sans. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Thank you. Hello, snowman. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring us very far away. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. All right. I will not eat it. <laughs> North, ice, south, ice, west, ice, east, snowed in town. And ice, of course. <laughs> it snowed in, damn it. We are snowed in. Uh, lesser dog. Ah, oh, bet. You barely lifted your hand, and lesser dog got excited. <laughs> oh, I thought you were gonna jump. Oh, okay. Let's keep heading. You lightly touched the dog. He's already overexcited. <laughs> Just keep heading. Uh, go away. The star is barking excitedly. <laughs> you pet the dog. He was a good dog. <laughs> pet. You pet the dog. His excitement knows no bounds. Excited noises. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> keep petting, keep petting. Critical pet. Dog excitement agrees. You have to jump up to pet the dog. Moving, revering, what? You don't even pet it, it gets more excited. Plane to call. <laughs> That's not how it sounds. There's no way to stop this madness. Kennel whistle. Unless your dog enters the realm of the clouds. Shows no signs of stopping. You know what? I don't. I don't really want to waste any more time. I'm sorry. I, I really don't want to waste any more time. Um. Actually, let me just for just to be safe. You know. Oh, oh God damn it! Hello, Snowdrake. Uh. Let's spare first. Fights you in cold blood. Ah. Uh, I have to spare you in order to make to. Let you make a pun. You laugh at Snowdrake's pun. See? Laughs! That was wrong. Uh, 
Go away. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, Sans. I need to go back to my box. Thank you very much. Please. No one. Please. Oh, Goddamn. <laughs> Hello, Eyes Cat. Ignore. It looks annoyed. Hello, my ass. Uh, I don't think I move, right? Shit. I knew it! Okay, ignore. Seems defeated. Okay, I'll ignore you too! Alright, this is easy, this is easy, this is easy, this is easy. Go away. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. I'll keep it here. Just so that I won't accidentally use it. <laughs> because the snowman will be very pissed at me. Alright. Let me save. <sighs> Shit. <laughs> Ignore. Go away. Hello, my hat's up here. Yeah, just don't move. Okay. Oh my god. Hi. I ignored you many times. You said you won't you said you will ignore me as well. This is easy, you just not need to move. <laughs> uh sorry. It's desperate for attention. Oh, I think that's why. That's why it just keeps coming. <laughs> Uh, you want a You really like being attention. Uh, I really want the money. <laughs> yes, hello. Shit, this is what. Oh my god. Ow. I'm out of here. <laughs> oh wait, I didn't spare it. It's, oh, god damn it. Oh, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. <gasps> oh no, oh ho, a human arrives. In order to stop you. My brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> Says, what did you do? I think the human has to hold your. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you, Papyrus. <laughs> hold this, please. Okay, try now. Incredible, you slippery snail! You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> he just lies and one walk, one walks away. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man. Isn't my brother cool? <laughs> Aw, Sans. Ice cream. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. It sure is. Oh, a customer! Hello! 
Would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen tree that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Here you go. Have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. Hmm. Let me buy one more. Nice cream is the frozen tree that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. It does. Like, come on. Eating ice cream during winter. The fucking best. Ooh. Alright, let's put you in. Push you in. Put uh oh. Go. Ah, shit. 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 It's gonna. It's gonna melt before I even put it in. Ah! Come on, please. Go. Go. Uh oh, it's shrinking. It's shrinking. It's shrinking. It's shrinking. It's shrinking. It's shrinking. Shit. Shit. No! Go in! Go in! Go in! Go in! Go in! Purple. Even when you felt trapped, you took notes, notes, and achieved the end of ball. You are born to gold. Thank you. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. How do you know? <laughs> Hello, Sans. I've been thinking about some trees too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Did I say five gold? I mean fifty G. Really? How about 5,000 G? 550,000 G. That's my final offer. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. Okay, we don't need to. Okay, no. You're right. That's still too low. God damn it, Sans. <laughs> Human! I hope you're ready for. Mm hmm? Sands, where's the puzzle? It's right here, on the ground. <clears throat> Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. <laughs> Monster Kids, work search. I see. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Okay, whatever. Sands, that didn't do anything. Oops. I know I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumbo is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Jumbo. Ha! <laughs> yes! Humans must be very intelligent. And they also find Junior Jumbo so difficult. <laughs> That's for saying Junior Jumbo just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Poor, poor him. <laughs> Alright, let's go back up. Because something. I think something's here. Ah, his. Smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell, puppy. Blue rating, smell of rolling around. Weird smell, humans. Green rating, destroy at all costs. Hers. <laughs> Aww, that's cute. They both have little stations together just next to each other. Up oh, there he goes. <laughs> He's gone. Ooh, safe. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Where's the mouse? <laughs> so cute. It's a note for Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap. <laughs> what do I say very weirdly? Designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. You're thoroughly jaded again by the great Papyrus. <laughs> Papyrus. Papyrus. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. 
It's so cold. It sucks in the table. <laughs> it's an unplugged microwave. Of the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> spaghetti, spaghetti, spaghetti. Hmm. Up. Oh. An ice cap and snow drake con confront you. Sighing, Jerry. <laughs> Uh, ignore. Hello, my hat's up there. Shh, I'm thinking, guys. I why didn't even get to read. Do do. Bop, 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 bop. <sighs> okay, it seems defeated. Better not snowflake out. Yeah, I won't. I won't. I won't. Okay, let's spare first, and then I will laugh at your joke. Oh my god! Ow! 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 Okay, Snow Drake, laugh at it. Yep, okay, you laughed. <laughs> I laughed. Okay. Okay, now I can spare you. Huh? Did they judge me? Some friends. The gym to you and the other monster to Jerry when it looks away. You won! <laughs> okay. Uh, it is right here. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click! <laughs> What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you are a smell, identi identify your smell. <laughs> identify your smell. <laughs> hmm, here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Okay, let's row around. Smell like a weird puppy. Okay. Shit. 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 <laughs> oh my god. Uh. Re sniff. You smell alright. What? It smells like a. Are you actually a little puppy? Okay, I think I'm fine. Yeah, just, just don't move. <laughs> alright, let's pet. Wow, pet by another pup. Well, don't leave me out. I will never. I will never leave you out, Dogaressa. Pet. What about me? A dog that pets dogs. Amazing. Okay, okay, okay. Spare. Thank you. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Aw, so cute. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Boop. And... Uh... What? How did you avoid my trap? And, more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Ate it. Really? While we, no one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, that's not human. I, Master Chef Pop Iris, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. Heh <laughs> <And> yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, we know that. Turn it off. So, oh, and boop. There you go. Hello. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Human. Hmm. How do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle. 
By arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different. And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, Worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. <laughs> uh, shit. I think it was... Did you, t did you just move with the camera? <laughs> I think I think you did. <laughs> okay. It was... Yeah, it, it was this side. Wow, you solved it! And you did it all without my help. Incredible! I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might be even be too easy for you. <laughs> Aww, he's so precious. Ah, oh, hello. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. You weren't even there. <laughs> Damn, Sans. Hi. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Elphis. You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impossible. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. <laughs> Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? So many words. <laughs> uh, uh, of course. <laughs> Great! And there, there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull the switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. <laughs> Get ready! Um. Ah. <laughs> uh. Twirly, twirly, goodbye. <laughs> All right, there we go, just like that. And um, oh no, <sighs> I was thinking about talk to Sans, but he teleported again. There's a lot of stillment here. Hmm. On the floor inside is a box of pomegranate raisins. Pomegranate and raisins. Knowing that dog would never get up trying to make the perfect snow dog. It fills you with your determination. Wait, oh, there's a dog here. A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built, it keeps getting more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until... It was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. Oh. Um, shit. Okay. It was this side. Wait. Something's not- Yeah! <laughs> it's a snow papyrus. 
This lump of snow with the word sans written on it with red marker. In red marker. Uh, <laughs> okay, it was this, and then this, 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 this. <laughs> okay, there we go. Whee. What kind of snow do we get? Oh, nothing. Let's try it again. A house. <laughs> and a hat. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. <laughs> Wait, do we? Oh, uh, yeah. Hello. What's up? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> yep, there it is. Griff top. Gif. Gif trot confronts you. Okay. Undecorate. You move the striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. That's a little better. Ow. Okay, slightly less irritated. Undecorate. You move a stocking filled with chicken nuggets. That's a little better. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Do -do 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 -do. You move the lenticular bookmark of a smug teen waking. A weight has been lifted. Crypto's problems have been taken away. Ah, there you go. Goodbye. Say, are you following me? Felt like you are the one following me. It's the door. Hmm. Yeah, we never know about this. <laughs> Goodbye. No, you're the one following me. Also, I really don't like those eyes. You sure do like the exercise. Okay, same same thing. Oh my god, what? Oh, you again. Hello? Uh, 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 okay. Just keep on doing. Keep on doing it. Keep on doing it. Oh, the weight has been lifted. There you go. No problemo. You're welcome. Is this a snow puff? And this is a snow puff. What is this? What a tiny dog house. Aw. Woof! <laughs> this, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, is a snow puff. Snow puff? Is it really a snow puff? Behold a snow puff. Eh? There's a 13 gold inside this. What is this? It's a snow puff. Yeah. Hello? Oh. Small doggy. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Okay, tell him to come here and bounce towards you, flickering slobber into your face. Greater dog is seeking fashion. Pet him. Greater dog curls up in your lap as soon as pet by you. <laughs> the kids will come through and fall asleep. Then he wakes up. He's so excited. Bark bark, bark bark, bark. Boop, 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 boop. Let's play with it. You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. It rests his head on on you. Bark bark, bark bark, bark bark. All right. Greater dog inches closer. Uh. Ow. Fuck. 
Let's pet him. Let's pet the dog. It seems his entire weight into you. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Okay. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. Where the dog inches closer. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. You pet decis decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with his legs hanging in the air. Oh, he's so cute. Ow! That's not cute. <laughs> okay. Goodbye! <laughs> he's so cute. <laughs> oh, Ooh, a bridge. Oh. Was it human? This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold the gauntlet of deadly terror. Uh, <laughs> the dog. <laughs> when I say the word, it world. <laughs> when I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire. Spikes will swing. Blades will slice. Each part will swing violently, violently up and down. I cannot speak today, Sans. What is wrong with me? Oh no. <laughs> Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to act activate it now. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge it, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton of what standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly caught. <sighs> Possession method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Whew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Nyeh. Heh. <laughs> okay, I almost followed the bridge there. Hey. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Okay. The sight of such a friendly town, is, town fills with determination. Snowden! Hello, Trevor. How can I help you? Ooh, I would like a bicycle and cinnamon bun. Should be enough. Let's talk. Say hello. Hiya. Welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I see a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? Here's chat. You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Grubby's has food, and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. <laughs> There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just show up one day and asserted themselves. Mm -hmm. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. So it's a good thing that they're here. <laughs> Think back to your history class. Long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost and, or can bury under the door, forget about it. <laughs> Life is the same as usual. 
a little claustrophobic. But we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? Oh, you're so faithful. As long as we got that hope, hopeful, not faithful. I, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't know. We can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Yeah. Yeah. Let me get one more bicycle. <laughs> Thank you. Bye now. Come again sometime. I will. Do, do, do. Sorry, um... Huh? Smell something? This is look like a pawn shop. I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Take your time. Okay, bye now, so I... yeah. I want to put away this tough glove because... I don't think I need it. Do I? Oh wait... Stat. Still got a faded ribbon. Bum, ba -da -bum, bum, ba -da -bum. Hello! Welcome to Snowed Inn, Snowden's premier hotel. One night is 18G. Sure! Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. You look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Okay, so well, feel free to come back anytime. Hello. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? <laughs> Boom, boom, boom. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Hmm? Isn't my cute? Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Awful teen stormer tormented a local monster by decorating his tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Hey. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell, because you're wearing a striped shirt. I wonder if that weird skeleton is an adult or a kid. <laughs> this town doesn't have a mayor. But there's a real problem. A skeleton would tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. Grubbies. Hello? I don't really have to have much time to talk to anyone. Everyone's always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Deariness, dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. <laughs> We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morals about it? Uh. Oh, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. <laughs> Last day, monsters and humans. Is it Dungeons and da Dragons? <laughs> you aren't gonna make me be human again, are you? Oh. What a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Ah, my patient rewards me. Ah, knocking. Knocking. <laughs> Hello. Strong boy. Bum, bum, bum. 
Welcome to the library. Yes, we know the sign is misspelled. Wait, really? Live. Oh, library. <laughs> I I didn't notice that. <laughs> I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. That look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumbo, aren't you? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one world search creator in the entire underground. <coughs> Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Monster History Part 4. Then, got some history press. But lessons. Fearing the humans no longer. Okay, we moved out of our old city, home. We braved harsh cold, damp swampland, and searing heat until we reached what we now call our capital, New Home. Again, our king is really bad at names. <laughs> because they are, mon they are made of magic, monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill, um, let's end the chapter here. <laughs> Genocide. Here I am writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry, I I'm still reading that one. Oh, that was you. Oh, I didn't, I didn't know. <laughs> While monsters are mostly made of magic. Human beings are mostly made of water. Did I read that right? <laughs> Humans with their physical forms are far stronger than us, but they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card. It's a school report about monster funerals. Monsters funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monster gets old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kinda sick of writing this. <laughs> okay. It's locked. can go behind, right? Yeah, it's locked, but I don't have the key. It's a mailbox overflowing with junk, with unread junk mail. This mailbox labeled papyrus, oh no. Look inside, it's empty. Oh, it's so sad. <laughs> oh, it's so sad. It doesn't have any mails from people. Stuck from the inside. But I'm probably the... <laughs> I think the males are probably, you know, bad stuff. Or maybe just people that want sales to come back to groupies. All that other stuff. Oh ho ho! Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another puzzle lover, the admiration for another's puzzle loving solving skills loving skills <laughs> the desire to have a cool smart person think you are cool these feelings they must be what you are feeling right now i can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way after all i am very great i don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like I pity your lonely human. 
Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then, I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Oh, Papyrus. What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I can make spaghetti. Oh no, you're meeting all my standards. I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date later, after I capture you. <laughs> okay, wait. Why do I have 30 HP? Is it because I I slept in the inn? So you won't fight. Then, let's see if we can handle my fabled blow attack. There it is. Ooh, okay. You're below now. That's my attack. <laughs> Alright, just keep sparing because we don't have it. Hmm. I wonder what I should wear. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. Ow. I do have 30 HP for some reason. It's probably because <laughs> I, I stepped in the inn, so yeah. A pirate stabs Mary Mary Nerys sauce behind his ear. Don't have ears. Hold up longer to jump higher, jeez. I know. I know. But you're so scary. This, this attack is so scary. Wait, what? Power stabs MTT brand Bishy Cream behind his ear. <laughs> yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Ooh, out. I am very bad at this. I can almost taste my future popularity. Uh. Ow. Fuck. Okay. Papyrus, head of the royal guard. Papyrus, unparalleled spectator. Beauty yogurt. <laughs> and Dine would be really proud of me. Papyrus realizes it doesn't have ears. <laughs> the king will trim, trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. Papyrus is preparing a bowl attack. My brother, well, he won't change very much. A Paris is cackling. <laughs> I'll have lots of admirers, but but what? But what? But what? Shit. Okay. A Paris whispers. <laughs> Were anyone like me as sincerely as you? Maybe. 
Ours is preparing a bone attack. <clears throat> Someone like you is really rare. rare. The bone attacks are getting very scary. Oh my god, Paul Virus! <laughs> the virus prepares a non bone attack that spends a minute fixing his mistake. And dating might be kind of hard. Me. Paris is rattling his bones. After you are captured and sent away. Paris is considering his options. Ah, who cares? Give up. Oh, I will not. Me. Oh shit. Shit. All right. Uh. Nice cream. An illustration of a hug. Your HP was maxed out. Aww. Give up or face my special attack. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. Papyrus whispers, <laughs> Not too long and I will use a special attack. Oh shit, uh, my, w my mind went blank for a second. <laughs> I forgot that was, that was not blue. Whoops. <laughs> this is your last chance before my special attack. Okay, this is blue. Shit. Shit. Uh, there you go. Lars was written, yeah. Behold my special attack. Oh. What the heck? That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Yeah. Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Paris is getting for a regular attack. Yeah, here's an absolutely normal attack. I don't think it's our oh, fuck. 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 I'm, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I am so dead. Did it do? Hello. <laughs> cool. Ah, dude. Shit. Okay, there you go. 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 Keep going up. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great papyrus, and like to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I'm so dead. I was so dead. No! I can't even stop someone as weak as you. And I'm going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the royal guard and my friend quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? What a loser. Okay, sorry. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess. I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, we I haven't even had a first date and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Who knew that all I needed to make pals? was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them. You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern, and then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, 
but nothing can exit except someone with a powerful soul like you that's why the king wants to acquire a human he wants to open a barrier with soul power then us monsters can return to the surface oh i almost forgot to tell you to reach the exit you will have to pass through the king's castle the king of all monsters he is well He's a big fussy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. Yeah. Hey. Ah, <laughs> uh, Alright, uh, let's go back to have that date as well. Hi, Boris. So, you come back to have a date with me? You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> Are you going back? <laughs> My house! Okay. Hello. Is a joke book. Take a look inside. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. Inside the stop. <laughs> It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down, move it. Okay. You move it two inches, move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Then you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> oh, hello. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it any time. Sure thing. Let me let me go inside. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a quiche, but filled with a sugary non-egg substance. How absurd! Hmm. Nothing. Aha! Uh -huh. Interested in my food museum? <laughs> oh yeah. Please, pers peruse my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers or labels for candy. <laughs> the other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look, see. Oh. What? Catch that meddling canine! Oh. Curses! <laughs> Sad! Stop plaguing with my life! Stop plaguing with my life with incidental music! You touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20 gold. Nice. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. <laughs> oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, don't judge me. Uh, a classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Bones. The door's locked. And there's fire. That's my room. If you're finished looking around, we could go in and do what better people do when they date. Go inside? Yeah. Ooh, cool room. 
So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Uh, no. Take your time, I'll wait for you. The internet. I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower account. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous throw troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns to the goofy font. Sans, isn't it? The computer's internet browser is open to a social media site. Hey! Those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it basically just happened. <laughs> there are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. Look in the closet. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. That bow box was one of my that box one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. <laughs> oh, so precious. Isn't that flag Nitro? And I found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> action figurines? Ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! Oh, I, I thought it was Al's core. <laughs> Okay. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair. Sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. <laughs> so, um, if you've seen everything, want to start the date? Sure thing. Okay, dating start. Dating will start. Here we are, on our date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snack an official... Oh, that was... Oh, he's holding a book. <laughs> I thought he was doing this. I snack an official dating book Rubo, dating Rubo from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press C. Press the C key on your keyboard for dating hard. Hmm. Reel it in. Wowee. I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two. Ask them on the date. Ahem. Human. I, the great papyrus. We'll go on a date with you. Sure. R really? Wowee! I guess that means it's time for part three. Wait, does that Saturday actually is like the real date? Because today is actually Saturday. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That ribbon in your hair. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that. Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning. <laughs> no. You planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. N no, your dating power. Ow. <laughs> Don't think you're best of me yet. I, the great papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, 
I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Yeah, what do you think of my secret style? I love it! No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> cool dude. However, you don't truly really understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This stage won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Hmm. Human souls are stronger than monster souls, but the souls of our shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. <laughs> Holding my hand shall I tell you the answer. No, I must resist. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. <laughs> you know, people think something. Mm, mm, mm. Right. <laughs> There's no secret to my legs. Okay. Shoulders. I see, I see. You're like caressing, caressing my biceps with a floating heart. But who doesn't? This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improve it. Expert tip. All clothing articles can be improved this way. I see. <sighs> yep. <laughs> My hat? My hat. My hat! <laughs> oh, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present j just for you. Oh, Do you know what this is? Spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right! But oh so wrong! This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Skilled silk and spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask, then cooked by me, Master Chef, Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. Mm. The taste is so indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking, and by extension, me. Maybe even more than I do. Uh, uh, no. Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, is all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy, is it hard in here, or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. Instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll have you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend. And act like this never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. 
Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me at any time, platonically. Well, gotta go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Shit. Keep pressing the wrong button. Uh, so. You're in my house. Good choice. Though I guess it's technically Sansa's house, too. But I prefer not to discuss his part of it. His room is. It's like in another world. A world where they don't know how to vacuum. <laughs> Alright, let's go to Waterfall. God, I look so dead. <sighs> oh, there's the eyes. Hello, Sans. Alright, let's save. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Alright, we're in Waterfall now. Well, it's only a checkpoint. It's still playing Sans' song, but uh, we'll, we'll get to this later next time, in the next episode, because... Yeah, we did everything. Uh, we, we met Papyrus, we befriended with him, we dated him. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I forgot how precious you can be, and it's just really nice, still very nice to get back to this game, because, again, Undertale is such a nice game, and you can make, be friends with all of them, and they're such cool monsters, they have nice soundtrack, nice designs as well, all that kind of stuff. Well, anyway, I will see you all next time for more Undertale.